Characters from your favorite Disney Pixar movies are back in toy form thanks to new Disney Pixar toys from Mattel. Hi, I'm Laurie from TTPM here with two types of toys for Pixar fans to collect, posable action figures and blind bag minis. It's so exciting to see some of these movie characters return in toy form, and if you want to stay up to date on the latest movie toys, then click subscribe below. I'm in the mood for an unboxing, so I'll start with the Disney Pixar minis. The circular bag features the signature Pixar ball on the front, with images of all the characters in the collection around it. You can see another image of the entire collection on the back of the bag. Open up the bag to see who you got. Characters include fan favorites Tomater and Dory. These little figures offer a super cute new look for favorite characters. Kids ages three and up will like the surprise of discovering who is inside and then playing out all sorts of adventures with the figures they collect. These might also be appealing to older fans who want to round out a Pixar toy collection. And speaking of older fans, I definitely think the Disney Pixar posable figures will appeal to them too. Check out the detailing on this eight inch Sully figure. It's textured to mimic fur, and there are purple spots on Sully's back, arms, and legs. The figure is very poseable with moving head, shoulders, elbows, wrists, tail, and legs. You can also collect a two pack of Mike Wazowski and Boo. Boo is four inches tall with poseable arms and a moving waist. Lift up on the monster costume head to reveal the head and shoulders of Boo inside. The figure has some nice texturing on it to mimic the materials used to make the costume. Mike is also about four inches tall, and along with moving shoulders, wrists, legs, and ankles, you can also move around his eye. The Mr. Incredible action figure stands about eight inches tall and wears the superhero's signature red and black outfit. This is a muscular action figure with moving head, shoulders, elbows, wrist, waist, legs, and knees. And there's a two pack of Wally and Eve. Eve is about four and a half inches tall, while Wally stands three and a half inches. You can pose Eve's arms and head, and Wally also has a moving head and arms. Though his tread wheels don't really move, there are two smaller wheels built into the bottom of the figure so that Wally can still roll around. I like the selection of characters in this first wave of figures. Do you have a favorite Pixar movie character? Tell me who it is in the comments. The posability of these figures makes them perfect for playtime, and kids will like recreating their favorite movie scenes. I'd say that because these are so different, they're going to have different pros, cons, and star ratings. So the pros of the minis are the cute tiny look, the unboxing surprise, and the appeal to collectors. I don't have any cons, so I'm giving these three and a half stars. For the action figures, the pros are nice detail and posability, creative play for kids, and appealing to collectors. I don't have any cons, so I'm giving these four stars. For where to buy in current prices, visit TTPM and subscribe to our YouTube channels for more reviews every day.